Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on The Flash Season 5. Today we're going to be talking about this amazing new piece of concept art that we've just been able to actually look at. So if you do go on to enjoy this video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you're new, so you don't miss any DC TV videos later this year. Okay, so, one of the concept artists who works on The Flash and works on the other shows, you've seen concepts for Rain, mon all these different characters including Kid Flash and loads of other characters on the CWDC TV shows and you see his concepts a lot and he posted a new concept the other day and this is really really intriguing and I think it's definitely worth its own video so that's what we're going to be talking about today we're going to be talking about Impulse so Impulse is a massive character so in the comics he's normally Bart Allen but obviously it can change from time to time due to you know it being comic books and everything changes so sometimes impulses from the future well normally he is he first appeared in Legion of Superheroes I do believe and so he is a futuristic character and he normally comes back in the past and so we've seen him on Young Justice more recently obviously he's rooted from the comics I think he was introduced in about the 1990s or so and he has a relationship to all the other members of the Flash family and his real name is actually Bart Allen normally in the comics and he when he was first introduced he suffered from this condition where that he was de-aging or he was aging sorry at a faster rate than any human being and he had to keep on running so that's why he sort of got sh shriveled up and like more small and more sort of decrepit in his sort of health problems and so they had to actually try and save him with the help of Wally West I do believe it was and so his grandmother is in fact Iris and his dad is Barry Allen sorry his granddad is Barry Allen and so there is the link there and if you've seen Bart in Young Justice you will know that he doesn't have that condition there so it's you know however they want to take it if they are actually going to introduce this character but apparently this was a scrapped concept art I have to emphasize it was scrapped so he could appear or he could not appear at all so that's all down to it but it's just really interesting that they were actually thinking about doing this someone contracted him to make this concept art of impulse as it says and if you look in closer as you will see on the screen right now this kind of looks like Wally West, but also a person I was talking to, they didn't think it looked like Wally West, so I don't know. I have the impression this looks like a Wally West sort of version. It kind of looks like Keenan Lonsdale. You can't 100% see it, but I think it's Keenan Lonsdale that they've based it on. And we'll break down the suit in a minute, but I do believe that this could in fact be... A version that they were planning to do perhaps in flash time sorry flashpoint originally instead of perhaps kid flash or maybe there was two different versions of himself due to flashpoint and due to the timeline changing and so that is a concept that may be happening that may have happened in the past so I don't know specifically about that and about how everything is going or how everything went in the past when they were originally designing this because this could be really recent, they could have got this concept really recently, or it could have been ages ago, we don't know, he never dated anything or told us, so it could have been in Flashpoint, it could have been before then, but this is definitely at the point where they knew Keenum was coming onto the show, or Keenum was already on the show, because it looks like it's modelled after Keenum, and so I believe if it is recently, this could be a sign that this is perhaps what they're going to be using or a different iteration because remember a concept is a concept and they make loads of concepts so what happens if they are going to be introducing this version of impulse but they're going to be using perhaps a different version of the suit in a different concept that they're using and maybe this is a scrapped one from recently this is just obviously me, th me theorizing a bit because we don't know when this was specifically made so for now, we're going to presume it was made really recently, so what happens if Impulse is coming to the Flash TV show? So, they could use it for the Tornado Twins, they could use a version of the suit for Nora's brother, because we know recently they cast, or they have been trying to cast, two babies of African-American ethnicity and being mixed-raced. 
for the TV show just to appear in a brief period of time in the episode, presumably. And this hints all the way to Iris and Barry having the Tornado Twins, having these twins that are massive in the comics. So that's Don and Dawn Allen. So maybe this is, you know, a different version of the timeline. Maybe it's to do with if the timeline changed. Was Barry and Iris actually supposed to have twins? Are they going to have twins? Is there a secret brother that, you know, Nora doesn't know or Nora doesn't talk about what's going on? But it seems like that is definitely happening, but we don't know if we'll see them in a older capacity. So that is one theory. Maybe they use this concept actually and change the comic book history and say, oh, Nora's brother or Nora's twin brother is actually Impulse rather than, say, Don Allen just, you know, as a name. Maybe this is just his superhero name at this point. Okay, so let's talk about another little theory. So, will we eventually see Impulse? So, it seems like 100% they plan to do it or they planned to do it. So, it's in their minds. That is the important thing. It's in their minds. They have thought about doing this, whether it was made recently or, you know, very or a very long time ago. They definitely plan to do something with Impulse. So, they took the time to do it and everything. So, I think eventually we are going to see impulse on the show which is very exciting if they finally get to do it because we've been theorizing when is Bart Allen gonna come on the show and if this is a version of Wally or if this is a version of Wally that is actually called Bart Allen or is you know just a different earth version of the Flash but instead of it being Barry it's Wally and so I think they're definitely planning to do that very soon or they did plan to do it and so Wally was originally supposed to potentially come as Impulse, that is another theory. Was he originally in Flashpoint when he was first introduced as, you know, Kid Flash, because before we knew Wally West and we knew his comic book history, but he wasn't a speedster at that point, but, you know, he got turned into Kid Flash due to Savitar. So was he originally supposed to become Impulse at one point rather than Kid Flash? I think that's a theory. Um, like I mentioned earlier, I think one way that they could have introduced Impulse as well as Kid Flash was through Flashpoint, through the timeline changing, maybe just with a suit change for him, maybe they plan to do that in Flashpoint, or maybe they totally plan to not include Kid Flash, but to include Impulse instead. So, the last theory, and the last thing I want to talk about, so is this a different version of himself? And does this link into what we're going to be seeing in Crisis on Infinite Earths? Because we know in Crisis on Infinite Earths, you have in the comics so many different versions of these characters. If you've read the comics, I 100% recommend reading Crisis before it comes out next year for the crossover. So is this teasing the idea that Impulse is going to be coming? You know, maybe along with Power Girl and all these different versions of our characters, you know, maybe Superman from Earth 2 or something like that. That would be highly intriguing, and I really want that to happen. So, is this a concept that was scrapped for the crossover? Because you would presume they're going to include loads of new heroes, even if they're just there to kill them off and be there in just a few scenes. They are going to have to concept the hell out of all of that, because they need to make these suits and make this new stuff in order for the crossover. So, I think that's a really good theory, if I'm being totally honest. And so, let's go ahead and actually break down the suit and talk about it because we've been talking about the possibilities about Impulse actually coming but let's talk about the suit so if you see on the screen right now you'll see the suit he has the very iconic goggles of Impulse and that's very exciting and it's over his mask and the mask shows his hair and it shows the top of his face he has the chin strap unlike Barry right now which he should totally have, but the earpiece kind of looks like the Kid Flash earpiece, and his hair looks very similar to Kid Flash, but the one theory about his hair is it seems a bit more sort of wavy, so is this in fact to differentiate Kid Flash, who has a very similar mask with his hair showing at the top, maybe his hair's shorter, and then, you know, this version of Impulse, he has longer hair, so is it a version of Wally West from another Earth. I think that's very intriguing. And so, yeah, it's all red. You get a bit of yellow on the goggles and a bit of yellow on the actual headpiece. And we get the suit, which is actually red and silver, which is a very interesting color scheme. And his flash symbol is, in fact, still red. It's not, you know, anything different. It doesn't differentiate 
from the actual suit, it's not like white or anything, because most versions of Impulse in the comics doesn't actually have that flash symbol, so that's an interesting point to note out. But yeah, the colour scheme is pretty similar to Impulse in the comics. The Impulse in the comics has a more sort of red and white outline rather than silver, but I think the silver is very interesting, and the suit as it goes down has these different sort of crevices, and the way the suit actually comes to life is very kind of stylized and it's a bit different from the comic book suit but I really do like it and as you go down to the shoes and the legs you get to see a sort of very detailed version of Impulse's legs because this is quite different from the comics but it sort of goes along the Flash TV show sort of side of things with the more padding type thing like the way that it's actually made and put together so I'm very interested to see all of this and also his gloves are red and that's the same in the comic books and at his chest and at his sort of torso level you see that it's like lightning bolt shaped and he has a belt and it goes down in lightning bolts so that's pretty similar to the comic book suit so that's very exciting so it's a mi it's a mishmash of the flash tv show style and of the comic book style and that's all very excited so Anyway guys, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys later. Goodbye.